What is up, guys? It is Spooky, and we are back here at Critical Hit at XSplit. And uh, we're going to be playing some indie games, which is the part of the show that I'm most excited for, of course. Uh, and the first game that we have up today is called Starbound, and it's by uh, the folks at Chucklefish, uh, Chucklefish Limited on Twitter. Uh, you can find them. Uh, this game was released about a month ago on Steam. It's very new. Uh, it was in early access for quite a while, but now it is out there completely. And you guys can also pick it up and try it if you like what you see. Um, very fun action slash adventure game, and we're going to jump right into it. So, uh, yeah, here we go. S start a new game. And uh, off the bat, you get to create your own character. And actually, this is pretty cool. You can randomize it if you really want. But uh, yeah, there's different species. Floran, uh, Nova Kid, Glitch. Uh, well, what? what was that? Your gender is <laughs> input or... Uh, okay, I get it male or female. That's cool. And uh, yeah, you can take off their clothes I guess if you really want if you're about that life so you can be like a naked Nova kid naked Florin a oh, Blue flower or red flower <laughs> Male or female all right, so uh, yeah, I'm just gonna pick something at random I guess I'll pick the Florin because it's what I picked the first time uh, and there's lots of customization here. You can change the flower color, your shirt color. I want that red shirt. That looks cool. Leg wear. It's more like crotch wear, but okay. Oh, this is the other part of the leg wear. Okay, I see. Personality. Okay, I like that one. Change your skin color. Oh, cool. I'm blue. Or light blue or something. I don't know. And then your name. I'm just going to pick something random. Mawam. Okay, I'm Mawam. All right. So I'm going to click on done and we're going to jump right into it. So this is a keyboard and mouse game. I don't even think you can play on pad. It's very story driven, as you'll see. Okay. If you are awake enough to do so, so all right, go to the bathroom. <laughs> Can I like wash my face? No, I guess not. All right, I'm a dirty person. I use the bathroom without washing my hands. You can also look around and interact with all this stuff. Toys. All right. You can also moonwalk. <laughs> All right, my inventory is empty. I have nothing. Anyway, let's go. So here, I guess, is the task that I'm supposed to do, and my first task is to attend my graduation ceremony. So we'll try to get that done. Yeah, you gotta clean up those cherry blossoms, bro. Okay, let's go. Oh, what is... Old fleshy man, dead now. Flesh person can't outrun Florin. You're walking kind of slow for someone popping off so much. More wrinkly flesh people. All right, anyway, let's go. Present them each with our greatest tool, the Matter Manipulator. Oh god. What's happening? 
Oh no, tentacles. Alright, so we have to pick up this thing, whatever it is. Matter manipulator. I believe what's supposed to happen is when we click on things, we can use this to shoot at them, something like that. Whoa, what happened? Picture is stabbed. All right, so what we have to do is to get out of this part. We have to actually shoot all this stuff. All right, now we can keep going. I can't go this way? Alright. The music's pretty cool. Pixels. Broken broadsword. Does that mean that I can equip that? Can I use it? Can I like chop at this thing or something? No, I guess not. Oh, you have to put it in the slot? I guess we can't use these close there. No, don't hit me. Maybe I do have to use one of these? How the heck do I equip it? Put it in one of the action slots. Oh, there we go. Alright. Red packs. How do I get to that inventory? So I press I. Okay, I see. Starbound. I'm going somewhere. I don't know where I'm going. I'm scared. Please reboot the system. Whoa, I woke up. Alright. What is that? Heart? <laughs> Alright, we're rebooting. I am Sail. Your ship base, artificial intelligence lattice. Okay. Well, I could definitely use some advice. Earth was attacked by an unknown force and was subsequently annihilated. No more Earth. The ship's navigation systems were damaged. Our location is currently unknown. Okay. To leave. And we are unable to leave or but I suggest you beam down to the planet's surface using the teleporter and search for supplies and perhaps a means of fixing the ship. And your rewards are... Uh, mysterious reward. Use this and open it to reveal contents. How exciting. Alright. Okay. Well, I guess we can't drive. I guess we have to use this teleporter thing. Is that what this is? Alright. Beam down to the current world. Let's go. Alright. We're somewhere. Do we still have this matter reshaper thing? Okay. Cool. We do. This part reminds me a lot of Minecraft. You just kind of break stuff. You collect it. I'm not sure if collecting it is very useful, but there you go. No idea if I'm supposed to go down here or if it's even a good idea to go down here, but I guess we're going. Oh, I cannot see. Dirt. Whoa. Pixels.
discover some plant fiber. This can be use, uh, woven into useful fr uh, fabrics. Okay. Oh, this is definitely making me feel like I'm playing Minecraft right now. <laughs> ah, oh no. Don't hit me. Please. Oh god, I need a sword. <laughs> I guess we're supposed to kill this too. Ah, uh -huh. don't kill me, please. How much health? Oh, okay, I see. So the red is my health. I wonder if there's a way to get health back. Cobblestone. Oh, I probably have those med kits, right? Yeah. Can I use this somehow? Restores 50 health over 10 seconds. How do I use it? Do I have to put it in a different slot or something? Oh, there we go. You click yourself after. Okay, that makes sense. All right. All right. So we can't really get back up easily unless we use our... Oh, no. No. Way, see where we end up. I don't want to linger too far away from the top until I kind of really know what I'm doing. Maybe that's too defensive of a way of thinking. I wonder if I can use all this dirt for something. out of bandages that's not good how do I get up here that's what I want to know cotton fiber sounds useful Tools can be built at a foraging table. So what's all this stuff in our inventory right now? We have... We have this sad... or oh, sod block. I thought it said sad block. Uh, we have a lot of dry dirt. Can we do anything with this? Oh, we can put it down? Oh, shoot. Well, that seems useful. Well, there you go. All right, cool. Now we can get up here. Ha-ha! We did it, boys. Oh, no. petals red petals no was that corn <laughs> wheat so far off. <laughs> oh god, that thing has a lot of health left. I should probably heal. How the heck do I use the med pack? Ah, I want to use this, please. I don't want to die. Let me 
got 10 pixels, whatever those are. Have no idea what the pixels do yet. More petals. Learn to craft risotto. How do I craft it? This is all the blocks and stuff I have. Mud, sod blocks, dirt, cobblestone. This is my weapons, I assume. Rice. Wheat seeds, wheat, cotton seeds. And I can throw things away. How do I actually make them? I guess I have to go to a certain part. First of all, we need to figure out how to do this. That's step one. Do I have to equip it somewhere? No. So gonna die if I don't figure out how to use this. Ah. Uh, Whoa, well, what are these? Okay. Power up the gate with core fragments, which we have none of right now. Collect core fragments. All right, so we have a goal. That's good. Deep below the ground near the planet center. Okay. So I guess we're going to have to go underground at some point. What is that? Manipulator, your this module can be used to upgrade a matter manipulator. With enough of these you can upgrade. Okay, and what is this? Iron ore can be used for smelting. Alright. I should just click take all that would have been way quicker, huh? Ah, I don't want to fight any enemies without healing, so we gotta figure this out. How the heck do I heal? R? No. It's funny because it says L and R, right? But then when I press R, that just equips this. How the heck do I use it? Oh, okay, I see. Oh, no, that throws it. That's not what I want. <laughs> I want to use it. Ah! Oh, there we go. That worked. Yay, finally. So it has to be in this slot for me to use it? That's weird. All right. Anyway, at least we figured out how to heal ourselves. All right, we need our, our sword. Oh god, no, I don't want to fight you right now. Please. <laughs> Hit him, yes. There we go. Oh god, don't hit me back. Run away. <laughs> Alright, now we can fight. We're gonna run out of mid-packs eventually. That's not good. Inventory crafting. Oh, okay, there we go. So we can make salves. Oh, well, that's good. Uh, craft. You can only make one. Florin flag. Wood platform. Torch. So you coal and oh, it tells you what the materials are. That helps. Plant fiber and timber. Rope. I guess this will help us climb back up. Why not? Let's make one. Craft. Cool. So we have a rope. Oh, you can only have one at a time? Oh, no, you can keep crafting. Okay, I see. This just says new because it's a new thing you can do. All right. All right, so it looks like we got some daylight coming. That's good, at least. Nice. 
No, I don't want to fight you yet, weird little thing. Now I do, yes. There we go. Haha. Uh -huh. Oh, I cannot see. Can I make something that... Oh, you can pick? So what is this? Expansion slot? Power generator? Optics? What is power generator? You need eight modules. You need six for this. Three for this. Twelve for this. So I guess we should do this first since we only need three. And it was a collection of liquids. What does this do? Increase area of effect to three by three. Uh, manipulator range by two tiles. And deconstruction rate by 100%. Okay. Well, it is so dark. You discovered coal. You can turn coal into torches. Alright. Well, let's break some of this coal up and then let's try to make some torches. So where is that again? Uh, crafting. Can we make a torch? Yes, we can. We need... Just coal? Alright. How many do you want to make? Oh, this is what we have materials available for, and this is... We're missing stuff. What are we missing? It doesn't say. It just says... Torch, light source. It doesn't tell you how to make them. That's weird. The other ones it tells you, right? Oh, okay. Wait, maybe I have to highlight it? Coal and wooden logs. So we gotta find some wood. I bet if I break up one of these trees or something, that would give me wood. Give him wood, haha. -ha. Don't fall on me, tree. That would suck. That would be like the worst thing that could happen if the tree falls on me. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Wooden logs. Okay. So now hopefully we can make torches. Yes, we can. We can make timber. Alright, well, let's start with this. So let's make some torches. Two, three. Cool. So now, where are the torches? I guess they're in our inventory somewhere. Rope. Maybe they get used automatically when we go underground? Let's see. for that idea. Oh, we found a torch. Uh huh. That's funny. How do we use a torch, though? That's what I want to know. It's got to be in our inventory here somewhere. Let's just keep looking. Mud, sod block, cobblestone, wooden logs, rope, solve. Oh, there we go. Torch. So I guess I equip this. Can I just put it there? All right. Now, if I click on this, and I click E, I assume? Oh, I have to put it down? Is that how it works? Okay. That's... That's still something. Well, at least I can kind of use these as a pathway, so I know where the heck I'm going. So that's nice. Whoa! No! Don't hit me! Oh, you can put them, like, on the wall. You don't have to necessarily put them on the floor. That's good. All right, well, we got to break up some of this area. I like the music a lot. It's really catchy.
Uh, we're running out of stamina. Is that what's happening? So we have to eat something? Or we're hungry? Alright. Do we have any food? <laughs> That's the next question. Or anything that even resembles food. We have seeds. Corn? So if I pick corn and I press E, does that eat the corn? Do I have to put it on the left side first, like before? Do I have to click myself? No, I didn't want to use the med pack yet. I wanted to use the corn. All right, let's pick it up again. Maybe I have to put it in the left slot. This is the part that I keep getting confused about. Didn't I eat it? Oh, there we go. Well, that was... That did not really fill me up, did it? We need more food. Corn seeds, rice, wheat seeds, wheat, cotton seeds. Is this food? Just for making bread. Well, we gotta figure that part out. All right. Maybe I can check the crafting menu. Campfire. Well, we cannot make much food. That's unfortunate. All right, guys. Well, uh, unfortunately, that's our time. This was really fun, but um, we, have to, we have to start switching over to the next game shortly. Uh, once again, this was Starbound, and it's by uh, Chucklefish Studios. Uh, lots of fun, as you can see. A very cool action slash adventure game. Very Minecraft-inspired, at least from what I saw. Um, yeah, looks really awesome. Anyway, next up, what is the next game, Ronnie? Is it actually Shio next? Oh, let's see. We have it in the list here. Uh -huh. Uh, yeah, it is Shio next, indeed. All right, guys. So Shio is going to be the next game. Um, so yeah, stick around, guys, and that'll be coming up in the next two to three minutes. We're just going to set up for it right now, and I'll see you guys shortly. Catch you guys in just a minute. <laughs>